obviously Chris Carter has the uh, height advantage. Yeah, I was actually going to ask you that, Paula. Since you've seen these wrestlers a lot more than I have, some for uh, just about 30 years, who knows? Who do you think has the upper hand in this match? Uh, honestly, I gotta say, Mascarita Sagrada has the advantage with the experience. Chris Carter is just a freak of nature when it comes to how innovative you can be in a professional wrestling ring. Do not count on Chris Carter though in this match. Let's see what we can do here. Already you can see uh, Chris Carter there making fun of a Mascarita Sagrada's height. Of course, of course. And there you Mascarita. go. Come on, Chris. Don't, don't do it, man. Do not make fun of Mascarita Sagrada's height. If I was Chris Carter, you never take a piss out of your opponent. Never, ever. It almost looks like Chris Carter has a little bit of arrogance himself today. It could be, just be a size thing. Crowd definitely feeling Mascarita today. Yeah. Yeah, Chris Carter and Mascarita Sagrada sizing each other up. And a sign of disrespect already. I told you there was some sort of arrogance going on with Chris Carter today. Would you blame him? He's looking at this guy, he's like, ah, not even half my size, a fourth of my size. Oh, what's he going for? Can't Already, even do the strength lock. Chris Carter trying to do a test of strength on Mascarita Sagrada. Oh! Oh, headlock takedown, there you go. Rolls him up to the two count, or one. And of course, <laughs> of course. A little mockery by Chris Carter. That's classic, man. When you, when you want to show your opponent you got the advantage on him. Uh, mind games are already being played by Chris Carter, which he is actually really good at that. Yeah. Nice little rake of the eyes, man. Let's see what Mascarita Sagrada can do here. Chris Carter wrenches the arm. There we go, nice little flip there. Oh, Mascarita Sagrada with the reversal. Tables turn quick with Mascarita, it seems. There's Chris Carter showing his agility and speed. Into a hammerlock. See what happens here. A snapmare takedown. Kick to the back. Oh, nice shooting star press. I'm gonna get in a two count. I think it's gonna take much more than that to get a three count on Mascarita Sagrada. Yeah, but what I will tell you here, Pablo, is Chris Carter should definitely not underestimate Mascarita. From what I've seen already, he has a lot of tools in his locker. Hell yeah, brother, you are absolutely correct on that. Mascarita Sagrada is a legend, brother. And there's Chris Carter mocking him. Let's see what Chris yeah. Carter has in mind. Oh, forearm to the back there, picks him back up from the mask. What's he gonna do here? Looks like he's setting him up for a suplex of some sort. Oh! Very nice. A suplex into a neck breaker. Yeah, a twisting neck breaker almost. Yeah, you're right, man. You're right. Uh, and just like we called it earlier, Pava, people having exchanges with the ref, they don't like this ref, they're, they're coming after him. That's not something you want to do, Chris. You never know what can happen. Yeah. <laughs> you see the referee warning him, telling him to get it back up and leave his mask alone. Let's see if Mascarita has to scout it. I guess not. An innovative move by Chris Carter. I tell you, man, it's not too often you see Chris Carter having the advantage over his opponent. I'd like to see Chris Carter put Mascarita in a tight hold here. 
really control the ring, control his opponent. Because we just don't know. Somebody with all the tools in their toolkit. There you go. What a nice backbreaker there by Chris Carter. A little elbow drop to follow that up. And this is what it's going to take. You see, one thing you got to know is a cover like that is not going to get you the, the three count, brother. A lackadaisical cover like that is just not going to cut it. It's not. It's not. Chris Carter has to do more. He has to do more here. Mascarita is not going to go away. You're right, man. Especially Mascarita Sagrada, man. It doesn't matter if you're seven feet tall or three foot tall, man. You better give it your all. There you go. Ooh, a nice splash. Mascarita Sagrada is showing you that he still has the speed after all these years. And agility, look at that. Into an arm drag. That's the line. Very nice. Nice tilt the world head scissors. Tope got the crowd off their seats. And I gotta say it one more time, if it ain't local, it, it ain't, ain't fire, fire that ain't. Ain't fire. There we go, you do not want to get into a chopping contest with Mascarito Sagrada. Sharp chops, man. Mascarita heading to the top ropes. What's happening now, Pablo? Oh, flying arm drag. Carter into the ropes. Oh, sunset flip reverse into a drop kick. So, what do you think, Pablo? Has Chris Carter underestimated Mascarita? It looks like he underestimated him too much, man. <laughs> Whoa! A splash and Chris Carter moves out of the way. Now both men down here. Let's see what's gonna happen next. Chris Carter needs to get back into control like he was earlier in the match. Look at the strength of the Look at that strength. What's coming next? Oh, Chris Carter moves out. Chris Carter up to the top ropes. What's he thinking? Oh, shooting star pressed by Chris Carter. And gets the three count. Whoa, whoa, whoa.
They're trying to change the game. And Chris Carter got the run of it.